Three, two, one. Babylon and Neo Babylon by Jake, Zoe, Aiden, and Charlie. In the 18th century BCE, a small city in southern Mesopotamia was created. The city was known as Babylon. The Babylonians had a great leader named Hammurabi. He is also famous for his 282 laws, also known as the Codes of Hammurabi. The codes are based off the concept of an eye for an eye. Also, Babylon was the center of a trading market. The major imports were wood, gold, silver, precious gems, and livestock. Their major exports were also grain and woven clothes. Babylon also had a very efficient agricultural system. Babylon's supreme god was Marduk. All the people of Babylonia believed in him. The Babylonians built roads and created a postal service. The Babylonians had measured seven days a week and 365 days in a year. In 1600 BC, the Assyrians conquered the Babylonians. O'Neill Babylonia was created in 612 BC. Uh, one of their greatest leaders, Nebuchadnezzar, rebuilt the city to reclaim the glory of Hammurabi's empire. New Babylon had massive learning centers, which was was key for making the civilization last longer. The, the Neo Babylonians also excelled in astronomy. They learned to chart the paths of stars. They were also skilled in math. Uh, one of the greatest achievements in Neo Babylon was the Hanging Gardens of Babylon. It is not only a great achievement, but is one of the seven wonders of the world. Nebuchadnezzar II had built the Hanging Gardens for Babylon for his wife, Aminus of Media, as a wedding gift. One. Sadly, it was destroyed by an earthquake in the first century CE. After that, he put up huge walls to protect their city. In 539 BCE, the civilization ended with the Persians attacked and conquered them. Oh. Citations.